water chemistry. Water balance is critical to your pool, plumbing, and water health. Being attentive to your water chemistry will ensure safe, non-corrosive water, and your pool will need less maintenance. We recommend two types of testing, self-test weekly and teddy bear professional lab test three times per season. Weekly testing. The two most important aspects of water chemistry are balance of free chlorine and pH levels. Self-test your pool water weekly to ensure proper balance. This is done by using our test kit. Perform two tests, the free chlorine test and the pH test. To test your water using your teddy bear test kit, we recommend using DPD number one tablets to test your chlorine instead of OTO drops, which test only for total chlorine. First, Fill the test vial to the mark with water taken from 18 inches below the surface. Next, add five drops of phenol red solution to the pH side of the unit. Then, add one DPD number one tablet to the CL side of the unit. Next, place the cap on the vial and invert several times to dissolve the tablet. Compare the color with the chlorine standard on the left, marked in ppm or parts per million. A desirable reading is between 1.0 and 3.0. Compare the color with the pH standard on the right. A desirable reading is between 7.4 and 7.6. For accuracy, you should replace any solutions in your test kit at the start of each season. Test kits should be stored in a cool, dark place. Teddy Bear Lab Test. Your pool water is exposed to many outside elements, the effects of which are not detected by the self-test kit. Professional testing is necessary to ensure your water remains safe and healthy for the duration of the season. Bring a water sample to the store for analysis three times per season, after opening, in the middle of the season, and prior to closing. Please use our free water test bottle or use a clean plastic container. Do not use empty chemical containers. Also, bring in a list of the pool chemicals that you have at home. In the lab, we will test for things such as total alkalinity, calcium hardness, total dissolved solids, cyanuric acid, pH levels, total and free chlorine levels, metals. Our lab technicians will provide you with a printed set of instructions on what to add to balance out your water, as well as recommended maintenance procedures. Chemical Maintenance Guidelines. Chlorine. We recommend using an automatic chlorinator they are convenient and economical. Additional directions on their use can be seen in the chlorinator operation chapter of this video. Other methods for chlorinating your pool include tablets, liquids, or granules. Remember, you should always maintain a free and available chlorine level of between 1 and 3 ppm parts per million. Although your water may be crystal clear, there may still be bacteria present. Algicide. Algicide is designed to inhibit algae growth and reduce chlorine consumption. Add directly by walking around the perimeter of the pool surface and pouring slowly. There are various treatment schedules for adding algicide to your pool, ranging from weekly to seasonal. Our lab will provide you with a detailed program for maintaining your water. Shock. Shock is used to oxidize swimmer and organic waste. Fill a plastic bucket with water. Then add bare shock and stir it with a wooden stick. Add by walking around the perimeter of the pool, pouring slowly to avoid splashing. If any shock remains on your pool bottom, brush it until it dissolves. Do not use your solar blanket on the pool for 24 hours after adding shock to your pool. 
You should remove all accessories prior to shocking your pool. You should shock your pool every other week. In the heat of the summer, you should use it weekly. Shock should be put in the pool with the filter running in the evening hours, not in direct sunlight. There are various methods for shocking your pool. Detailed information can be found in our retail store. Remember to always read and follow label instructions on pool chemicals and products.